Music for me, or for Ganesh Kumaresh, is more about an experience. Experience of emotion, feeling. And we have grown up with the concept that music is more about heard and unheard melodies. But here I'm going to talk about music. It's a bit complicated. I think it is more easy to play than talk. Why talk is because uh, it is the new age understanding that everything has to be simplified, explained, simplified so that people can digest and understand it. Understand music? Do we really understand music? I don't know. I'm still trying to understand music. Anyway, um, how many of you know Carnatic music here? Great. That's quite a few. So what I'm going to talk initially is to the non carnatic audience. Carnatic music is one of the oldest and most defined system of music, both melodically and rhythmically. It is multi-dimensional in its form. Then in a, uh, in a Carnatic music performance, you have uh, musicians generally performing Kritis, Varanam Tilanas of great composers, saints and all that. Vocalists sing the song and we have many instruments like Veena, Violin, Flute, Nadaswaram, Gotwadyam and Mandolin, Saxophone. They all again sing through the instrument, meaning they play songs which have lyrics on the instrument. This was a bit strange to us. As we where as we were growing up, as we were expanding the horizon of Carnatic music within ourselves, we found that instruments need not play lyrics. They have seven notes, that is more than enough to express themselves. Why do they need to confine their expression to vocal music? Hence, we devised this form of presentation, Raga Pravagam, I won't say it is our invention. It is one of the multi-dimensional aspect of Carnatic music. We are just reinventing. So the best way to present to you will be to play a composition. I will play a composition. After that, if we have time, we will interact. I can play, right? Is it okay? I didn't play that, okay, not me.
thank you very much now among the carnatic audience how many of you identified the raga ha huh? wonderful begada so ide begada is yeah he needs one correct you are right begada is a very hardcore intense carnatic raga and generally people in our students they learn or they perform fantastic compositions like nado pasna che or vallabana ekasya of composition of jaga utsama dikshit or like that but those are the vocal dimension of the raga what you heard now was the pure sound of violin in the ragam begade you heard the different sounds the long bows short bows the plucking sound traversing four five octaves which is possible in the instrument so the idea behind behind raga pravaham is that every instrument should play for itself to bring out its own beauty lyrics are like a dress in our body but for instruments you don't need lyrics see we always talk about history carnatic music has got a great tradition great past so we let it let us take history as an example we see great god heads you have goddess saraswati you have krishna you have vishnu you have ganesha you have lord shiva if you look at their the picture you have saraswati playing the veena you have krishna playing the flute you have vishnu other avatar he plays the conch and uh, ganesha he is a super hero the navarasa he plays guitar he plays keyboard he plays he plays lot of lot of instruments same with shiva he plays a damaru none of them sing they all play instruments so we can can we say gods play instrument in the sense why when we say god he is beyond division is beyond boundary he is omnipresent he doesn't need language to identify himself so is instrument instrument has a, has got its own language the sapta swaras or the seven notes violin is played in western music violin we can play hindustani music we play carnatic music we, we play folk music irish music they they all have the same seven notes the way you play should identify the system you do same with veena same with flute same with nadaswaram so what we are trying to say is that this was the original form of music the saptaswaras came from instruments the gamakas came from the veena and related instruments most of the vocal techniques today has been adapted from instruments that being the case why not instrument identify themselves as themselves rather than be a caricature of voice because when you try to emulate voice you can never match up to it i can communicate language through music through through instrument i can't communicate language i can only communicate melodic sounds so that is the idea behind raga pravaham if you have any questions we have 3 minutes we can have an interactive session so that anybody wants to know something because music is more about heard melody so you can ask me something i can tell you before that did you guys at least grasp something about what i said could you understand what i said no you did not understand please the big guess will make me very happy thank you any questions you want to ask please ask anybody great nobody wants to ask any question they all understood thank you very much nobody wants to ask you want to ask so they all understood i did i gave a great speech thank you thank you thanks for the wonderful opportunity uh they want a small piece to conclude can i put yeah. more a talk session no should you think i should play again i don't think so
ఉపయోగపడి వాట్ యూ వాంట్ మీ టు ప్లే వాతాపి గణపతి నిఖిల్ వాన్స్ వాతాపి గణపతి సి ఆస్ మీ లిరిక్ మ్యూజిక్ నౌ thank you friends thank you very much i thank ted for giving me the wonderful opportunity to present our reinvention of carnatic music thank you